Hi guys, my name is Belle and today I'm going to be talking about Tralala the Tiger, the self-love plushie. Just to give you a background on how I decided to come up with this. After I gave birth, I did go through postpartum and I went to seek help. And my therapist told me that I needed to constantly say affirmations to myself in front of the mirror. Now I had never done this before and I found it so silly. Um, but because I was desperate, I started to you know, talk to myself in the mirror and say positive things. And I found that it really, really helped heal me. And with my journey, I learned that I needed to accept myself. And one thing that my, my, my therapist did tell me is you have to know that you're enough so that your son knows he is enough. And that really shook my belief system because it's true that you know what we see I guess in our parents we end up modeling them even if it's unconscious so I wanted to change my way of thinking and and speaking to myself and pass that on to my my son and we started doing affirmations he was just a baby and everybody found it so silly and you know, it was like, why are you even saying those things to him? He's like eight months or six months. So I decided to make a cartoon called Tralala. And in the cartoon, it talks about self-love and introducing self-love to children at a young age. And during the pandemic in March, we were locked up in the house for, you know, several months. And I realized that my son was growing older and he wasn't anymore repeating what I would ask him to or or do the affirmations with me instead he would copy what his toys were saying so I thought why don't I create a toy so that he can repeat what the toy says and I was fortunate enough to be here in Hong Kong because I was able to source different toy manufacturers and you know after a very lengthy process and having it tested and many many samples and so this is what we finally came up with or what i finally came up with this is chalala the tiger the self-love plushie um, i put on a mask but it can come off easily the reason again why we put on a mask is because my son didn't want to wear masks when we would go out and i found that it was easier to model it on the toy and then he would copy it so if you press his hand right here you can see it, it says try me Tralala says about six to seven affirmations that I say with my son in the morning and try to repeat it at night. And we can listen to him now. I am beautiful. I am unique. I am smart. I am loved. I am perfect just the way I am. I am enough. So those are positive affirmations. And what they do is Basically, your child or you hear them every day and it's a gentle reminder to know that all the things that Tralala says, that you're beautiful, you're unique, your child is unique, you're perfect just the way you are, you're enough. Um, and the reason why I chose these affirmations is because, you know, being an aging millennial in this generation, we're constantly exposed to the pressures of social media and um, unknowingly we compare our lives to other people because you know we constantly see it now I don't think all of social media is bad I'm just extrapolating all the negative effects that it could potentially have for a child and so I created this doll because I found that as a parent you do tend to compare your parenting and your child with other parents and other children and it was a great reminder for me to know that my child, Balthazar, is very unique and he's different and he's perfect just the way he is. Even in all his bad side, when he has tantrums, when he's having a hard time. So really what I wanted Tralala the Tiger, the self-love plushie, to communicate is for children and of course parents to be reminded that everybody is very different and each child has their own set of needs as well as parents but this this plush toy reminds you that it's okay to be different and and we love you no matter what everything that you are is enough you don't have to earn my love you can just rest in it 
and I hope to develop a, you know, a harmonious self-acceptance relationship between the parent and the child through this flesh toy. So I hope you guys like it and I hope that it will positively impact your child's upbringing and yours as well. This is good for adults too.